for simplicity we will use Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 release 2 to abstract from complexity it's an easy way to open the form with parameter is uh, through the job let's go ahead and open um, a new development workspace then uh, just create new job I did already and then copy this code into this job take a look at this code first of all it requires the arguments which we're not going to use in this examples instead we will fill up our own arguments like this so the uh, we'll try to find the record in the table and this is asset table you can take a look here you can execute this uh, script like this and then you will see the assets we'll pick uh, I think the, let's try to pick this one so this is gonna be our asset ID that's what we hard code here this asset ID and then we will provide a uh, direct name of the form which you can find here asset um, table Here's the form. Okay, and then now uh, we're gonna initialize the form, and then uh, we will call form scripts. Init, run, and wait. Okay, you can run this directly from uh, development uh, environment by clicking here and you will see that we got exactly the form we wanted to be open with uh, the this asset number asset ID so this code is uh, on the tutorial level for familiarizing somebody who is new to X++ and uh, probably it's easy to do this on AX 2012 because it could be installed on premises and does not require Azure hosting. Thank you for watching.